hair shop, not the same one, one across the street from where I got my hair, got my hair done, but I have it up because it's really full and thick. I'm not complaining about that, but I didn't have enough loose to contain it, so I need to go get some. I thought I had a lot, but apparently I didn't, so maybe one of the girls used it for their hair. But anyway, I'm going to the other side of town again to get some gel, not gel, mousse. And y'all, so I went to check the mail today, even though today's a holiday. I know there's mail in there, but my key won't work. And it was sticking a few times here and there. I don't know what's happening, but I was thinking, I'm like, I'm gonna go to the post office and I'm going to let them know so I can get a new key made or whatever the process is. And I forgot, today's a holiday. So I'm gonna have to wait till tomorrow after work and then go to the post office and let them know. I'm gonna try it again later on. I can barely get the key in. And then when I do get the key in, it won't turn at all. So. Hey everyone, it is Friday after work and I'm just about to run some errands, but I'm leaving the post office right now. Remember when I told you guys that my key to my mailbox was sticking and it only works sometimes now? So I had to come back with proof that I owned the place and my ID. I just needed like my mortgage statement to prove that I own the house. So I did that and I had my key. She told me that it'll be $50 if I don't give them my key, but it'll be free if I give them my key. And I'm like, okay. So I come in and I tell her what I need. And she says, okay, $50 and I'll need all three keys. And I said, okay she told me and i told her i said the girl standing next to you and i was nice about it or whatever i said she told me it will be free if i give you my key and i'm going to give you my key you know because it barely works anyway so i'm really not getting any mail out and then she said okay well we'll honor it this time but next time it'll be fifty dollars okay whatever i don't care just get it done and then she said i'll need all three keys and i told her i said I have only had one key when I moved into the house. When I bought the house, I was only handed one mailbox key. And she says something and she then she goes, and I'll need all three keys. I said, ma'am, like I just said, <laughs> when I bought the house, I was only given one mailbox key. But there's usually three. I don't care what there usually is. For the third time, and I didn't say this like this, I don't, I'm not the type to get loud or belligerent or whatever like that in public. And I told her, I said, I have one key, one key. And then her coworker had to tell her, just take the key, you know? I don't know what she wasn't understanding. I, I don't get it. If I told you twice, if I told you once, I only had one key. Sure, at one time, there were three keys, but, I, I just can't believe I had to tell her literally three times I don't have three keys. I only have one. I don't I don't get what's so hard about that. And I wasn't mad or upset, but she was getting me to that point because I'm constantly having to repeat myself. That's just like I I, I, I don't get it. I don't get so it. So I'm at Loving Hut. It's a all vegan restaurant. And I am cooking tonight, but it's not vegan, so I feel bad for Savannah, so I'm just going to pick her up some of her favorites. dinner thank you Edna for showing me to put mustard not just me but I seen that you put mustard on your chicken one time and oh my goodness it's so crispy and so good so this is dinner and with a cucumber salad and yum can't wait to eat good morning everyone today is Tuesday and 
I'm on my way to work and I'm excited because today is my last day of work for the rest of the week because this week at my church there's a huge conference there's classes during the day well not classes well church service during the day there's also ladies day on Thursdays and so this is the first time that I've taken off to go to the day service and so me and the kids we have off the rest of the week today is our last day of work also so yeah we took off for a church conference even though it's in town yeah I'm excited about that and I probably have marks in my face from the machine hopefully it'll go away by the time I get to work because yeah I'm feeling better with the machine I will do a separate video to talk about that um, so yeah let's get going we plan on getting there super early because if you're on time you're late and you won't get a seat if you're there when prayer time starts you may get a seat probably not so we're going super early and the girls I did I tell you guys yeah the girls are singing in the choir but the choir doesn't sing tonight the choir sings the rest of the week so yeah I'm excited and yeah I feel like having you guys here well it's already a horrible angle but looks like I don't have any hair yeah yeah anyway you guys all right let's get to work get this day over with so we can have off the rest of the week. I'm excited. Okay, it is after work. Um, I'm ready. We are on our way to um, our conference. And I didn't even mention, I know you guys seen that at the end of the last video, I got my hair. So I did get my hair done, but I haven't been wearing it down because it's a little too frizzy. Not frizzy, it's just a little too full. I like the way she did it, but it's just too much of it. I don't know, I just, I've been wearing it up lately. Except these little, whatever you wanna call it right here, so. Yeah, come on, Savannah. All right, see you when we get there. Thursday and um, I told you guys I'm off the rest of the week and the reason why I haven't been vlogging consistently all day is because we have been having church service after church service which I'm not complaining it's wonderful church service in the morning a break at night you know a break during the day and then back to church service and then choir practice before church so it's been basically shower rinse repeat so that's the reason why I haven't vlogged everything but I've been trying to vlog here and there so you guys can see what we have been up to this week today 
this morning it's 8 15 and we are headed back to church because today is ladies day and they have special speakers and the men are at our old church not our old church but the old church building for this new church that i'm going to and men's have the men's day so that's what's going on today and yeah if i get the vlog a little bit when the speaker is speaking i will but y'all usually i'm into it and yeah so we'll see all right the kids are coming and we are on our way So today is Friday and I'm working from home today. I'm just taking a little break because I need to close out this video finally. And it's been about a week since the conference. And yes, you guys can see I have my hair done and I'm still liking it. It's just, it's this kind of hair gets a little matted sometimes. I have to really keep the product that I use on it like on a daily. Otherwise it will be matted. But anyway, I think I will throw in a video of my hair, me getting it done because she did put me on her Instagram. So I'll do that now. Okay, so anyway, like I was saying, it's been a week since the conference was over and I didn't vlog any of the preaching or anything like that. And not because I didn't want to or, you know, anything like that. It was just pretty much shower, rinse, repeat. And not in a boring way. It was so good. It was awesome. The music was awesome. There were so many people there. And yeah, you guys, we had such a good time. And yeah, I can't wait until next year. Um, yeah, we've been to this conference before, before we attended the church. Now we got to go to it being members and I don't know, it just has a different feel to it. And I love my church so much, the freedom of worship and just the whole dynamic is awesome. We get what we need as far as the preaching where the other church we were before my past, my previous pastor got sick. That church we were not getting what we needed at this church now I feel the spiritual liberty that I used to feel at my old church before my pastor got sick so yeah you guys um I don't know my hair is kind of looking wild right now that's why I keep looking at it anyway I'm trying to think if there's anything to update you guys on or if there's anything new that's happening and no and no Hope you enjoyed this video, probably all over the place, but y'all know how it is with me right now. Mm, yeah. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.